So the 49ers are keeping Jimmy Garoppolo another year as a backup quarterback. They now have two quarterbacks they can win with, and things are looking up for them. Just one question, though. If the Niners' plan all along was to have Jimmy Garoppolo as their backup quarterback, why wasn't he participating in training camp? Why wasn't he in meetings? Why didn't he even have a playbook? It seems like the plan was for him not to be on the team. And they changed the plan at the end. Well, what happened? I think the initial plan was for Nate Sudfeld to be the backup quarterback. That's why the Niners gave him $2 million guaranteed. They were really seriously convincing themselves that Nate Sudfeld could be a backup quarterback and win a couple of games if Trey Lance went down. Then Sudfeld was so bad this offseason that they actually had a backup quarterback competition halfway through it between him and Brock Purdy. And no disrespect to Brock Purdy, but he's not a number two quarterback yet either. Uh, Jimmy Garoppolo is. So really, I think it's fair to question the Niners' initial plan at backup quarterback. Nate Sudfeld? That was the plan? Since that plan was so ludicrous, it really forced their hand to stick with Jimmy Garoppolo. Because if they had been a little bit more ambitious at backup quarterback, got someone like Andy Dalton, you know, if they had gotten someone like, oh, I don't know, Tyrod Taylor, they could have gotten rid of Jimmy Garoppolo. They wouldn't have to worry about the locker room maybe being divided and extra, you know, uh, scrutiny being on Trey Lance. You'd still have an excellent backup quarterback. But the Niners went with Nate Sudfeld. And then realized that he was not an option. And now the Niners have to get Jimmy Garoppolo ready really fast to be a backup. And I'm not, I don't know if he's ready. I guess Kyle Shanahan and John Lynch will talk about that later today. But I saw Jimmy Garoppolo throwing on a side field. It didn't look like he was throwing hard. It didn't look like he was throwing far. He was throwing a bunch of short passes without much velocity behind him. So now they're going to have to stretch out his arm and get him prepared and teach him the playbook and how long is that going to take? I mean, it's great that they have a, a good backup quarterback. Yesterday, I said, I'm, I'm picking him to go to the NFC Championship game again because if Trey Lance gets hurt now, Jimmy Garoppolo can fill in for a little bit if needed and the Niners can still win. But when will he be ready to do that? Frankly, he needs to be ready to do that week one just in case. And it's like the Niners' fault that he's not. Why was he not practicing? If this was the plan to keep him as the backup, he should have been on the field learning the playbook in the meetings at least, right? Even if he wasn't physically fit to practice, which they said he was, he should have been in the meetings. So something changed. I'm thinking it was Nate Sudfeld being awful and the Niners realizing we don't, they don't have a backup quarterback. They need a backup quarterback. But still, Jimmy should have been more prepared. He should have been in training camp. Let's see what Kyle and John say about this in a couple hours.